All right, so if you're here for audio, you're in the right place. But I'm going to break down a quick little secret or tip that a lot of people don't know about. First, let's get all this out of here. Boop. You're going to go to settings. You're going to click on your settings. You're going to go to system, display, sound, notification, power. You're going to left click that. Bam. Once you left click that, you go to sound. You left click that. Bam. Then you're going to scroll down and you're going to left click advanced sound options. Boom. Then this is going to pop up the magic app volume and device preferences. Woo baby and you're gonna see apex legends it's like magic bro <laughs> so once you see apex legends you know that you're heading in the right direction so hopefully in your mind you're like getting happy right because you're in the right uh spot <laughs> and your head is telling you like oh yeah so now with that being said you're gonna scroll down you're gonna see OBS, you're going to see Steam, you're going to see your Stream Deck. This is how I wake up feeling some days. I just leave it all on real tech. It's bleeding through my mic. Just because I have a, a USB plugged in and I'm getting all the audio through there anyway. I don't know if you understand because I'm using a mixer. But the bottom line is that this is where you mess with things that that's gonna fix your audio trust me if you're using hardware mixer and all that is in here your uh usb if you have a usb plugged in even though i'm using an xlr microphone i have a usb plug plugged into the back because my mixer has a power cord and a usb i don't know if you get it if you understand but whatever here's you Either or is going to work for you. Default works for some people. It don't work for me. But this is where it's going to save your life here. Right now, I'm about to go stream on Twitch at my channel called On The Lockout for gaming. And I feel like leaving it all on real tech. I don't feel like dealing with, uh, let me see if it's working fine. Those things happen. So I'll let it bleed through the mic, to be perfectly honest. And in game, I'll mute them. <laughs> so if it's bothering them, they can't tell me. And my stream, he is a perfect audio, right? But it's bad because I'm not worrying about the other people. So I normally try my best not to do that. So everyone could be cool, right? And they want to play with you. Not that when they see your name, they run away because they're hearing echo within your game. So if you want to stop that, that's the place for it. I'll repeat it again for you so you don't have to rewind the video. Are we still using rewind? I'm old. Okay, so go here, go to system, hit sound, scroll down, pop. There you have it. And you want to switch this to go through either your UBS, your UBS, your USB or what have you. Or you want to disconnect that extra 3.5 millimeter jack that you have connected into the back line out of your pc if you're working with a mixer and learn how to utilize the buttons in your mixer and learn your mixer that's what the problem is a lot of us don't know our mixer and it's so sad uh, uh, uh i can't say like it's not like a major sad situation but i felt like bro it's not me right but it's you bro it's you and you gotta like the only thing i don't like is pressing the button on and off in the mixer like let me press now i could talk and the stream hears me but they can't hear my end game and then when i want to hear the end game unpress the button and then if you're using it this way and i unplug the out then i can't control the volumes via the mixer because i'm not using uh 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 these other cables, RCAs, plug to go through the USB, all this other stuff. So to make it simple, some of us just go to real tech and let it bleed through the mic. And it's not cool. But this is where you fix it at, bro. I said all that to say that. <laughs> right there, those settings are going to change your life. And if you need anything else, right now with OBS upgrade twenty uh twenty eight dot o dot one. They incorporated this right here, which is application audio captures and beta pop. But what it does is you hit that, right? And uh, you see right here, I got Discord audio. 
you can hit OK, and it's going to say what you want to capture. You see, it's using it as a window capture. I don't know if you're being able to see that. Hopefully you are. But Apex, you press on Apex, pop, and that's going to be capturing your game. So they did a lot of things to incorporate so that you can capture separate audio. So that's cool too, right? But I think you're still going to wind up going back here to where we first started because this is a very very important spot here so keep that in mind that that's where it's at for you to deal with your audio another tip is this right here where your speaker icon is at on the right tap that just in case you have usb and real tech then you have to put it on that if you're using real tech you want to listen real tech me i have a uh, a uh, uh, headphones and they plugged into my mix or whatever to be honest i leave it on real tech when i'm using real tech and i and it's just bleeding through people's <laughs> uh, through my mic but other than that it has to be on usb when i change everything over here on usb if that makes any sense to you right leave a comment let me know if you would like to see more videos like this or what you would like me to show you next. I stream every day on Twitch, On The Lockout. I have a YouTube channel called On The Lockout with my stories, how I started making content, where I'm going with this, how far we've made it, and the people that I've helped grow their platforms to millions, millions of views and subscribers. Thank you for watching. Stay out of trouble. Stay safe. And good luck on your journey. And I hope you get everything you want out of life. Keep in mind, you get out of this what you put in. So post, post, post. And when you get tired of posting and streaming, post and stream again.